Average birth weight of a baby born at 34 weeks. Hello everyone. Welcome to today's video where we will be discussing the average birth weight of a baby born at 34 weeks. This is an important topic as premature births can have unique challenges and considerations. So, let's dive in and explore the average birth weight for these little ones. What does 34 weeks mean in terms of gestational age? Before we talk about birth weight, let's clarify what 34 weeks means in terms of gestational age. Gestational age refers to the number of weeks since the first day of the mother's last menstrual period. It helps determine the development and maturity of the baby. Factors that influence birth weight at 34 weeks Several factors can influence the birth weight of a baby at 34 weeks. These factors include gestational age. Babies born earlier in gestation tend to have lower birth weights compared to those born closer to full term. Genetics. The parent's genetic makeup can influence the baby's birth weight. Maternal health. The mother's overall health and any medical conditions can impact the baby's growth. Maternal nutrition. A well-balanced and nutritious diet during pregnancy plays a crucial role in supporting the baby's growth. Average birth weight at 34 weeks. Now, let's get to the main question. What is the average birth weight of a baby born at 34 weeks? It's important to note that every baby is unique, and there can be a range of birth weights. However, on average, babies born at 34 weeks gestation weigh around 4.75 pounds or 2.15 kilograms. Growth and Development of Premature Babies Premature babies, including those born at 34 weeks, require special care and monitoring due to their early arrival. Their growth and development may differ from full-term babies, and they might need additional support, such as staying in the Neonatal Intensive Care Unit NICU, for a certain period. To summarize, the average birth weight of a baby born at 34 weeks is approximately 4.75 pounds or 2.15 kilograms. Keep in mind that this is just an average, and individual babies can vary in weight. If you have any concerns about your baby's growth or development, it's always best to consult with your healthcare provider, who can provide personalized guidance and support. Thank you for watching, and I hope this information has been helpful to you. Remember, every little one is unique and deserves the best care possible.